Hey folks, I'm going to show you a really good way to, to cook the chicken of the woods tonight. Um, I picked this chicken today. It is probably about as fresh as it's going to get. This is the late porous sulfurious. Got the yellow underside. Oh, there's a <laughs> there's a bug on it. But I'm going to I'm going to cut this up in nice long strips, okay? And I'm going to saute it with some onions and with this orange pepper here. And what I'm going to do is after I saute it up, well, while sauteing, I have oh, two pounds of venison hamburger here. I'm going to cook a nice big hamburger. I'm going to saute this stuff in some butter and some seasonings. And when it's all done, I'm going to put it on, or I'm going to put this on top of my hamburger in the pan. And then I have some baby Swiss cheese here that I'm going to throw on top of that also. Throw a cover over it, let it melt, and put it on some nice, this is, this, these buns here were made by the, the local bakery and that's gonna be part of our supper tonight so um if you'll stay tuned i'll get that done for you so i got my chicken of the woods here i got some onions i got some orange peppers in my pan uh right here is one of my favorite seasoning nature's seasoning blend it's a morton product um gosh See here, I've, I've tried lots of different blends. If I can get my phone to zoom in on this, possibly not. Oh well. Oh, it's got celery, parsley, pepper, onion, garlic salt. There you go, all kinds of good stuff in there. Got my venison burgers here. I'm gonna sprinkle some of this on here and get this all sauteed up and give you another, another shot here before I put it on my burger. Alright folks, there's a, there's a picture of those chickens and uh, the onions and the peppers. A good picture of that. Ooh, there you go. Getting all nice and sauteed up. They'll be ready to put on that burger here shortly. Alright, so here we got my venison hamburger. Um, I drained all the grease off that burger right there. And here I have all my, my sauteed stuff my my mushrooms my onions and more importantly the chicken of the woods look at that can't tell me that doesn't look good and I'm gonna put it all well I'm gonna stack it right up on my burger here As you can see, I'm literally just piling it on my burger. <clears throat> Over here, I got my Swiss cheese. Put a couple pieces of, piece of that on there. Just like so. And I'm going to cover this now. My it's just, it's just on warm. So I don't have to uh, worry about it getting cooked, you know, too much and whatnot. Um, here, I have my plan of tape, my pan of tater tots here. I'm gonna let this melt for a minute. All right, there's my burger, all my fixings on it. Ooh, look at that monster. I'm gonna set it right on top of my bun here. Well, I'm gonna try to anyway. <laughs> Here we go. There we go. <laughs> Sorry about that, folks. I'm doing some self-filming here. But you can see, there's my burger. All that good stuff. I still have some left. Where do you think that's going to go? Yeah. Right there on the plate next to it. Oh. And that is pretty much a side. Uh, I'm going to throw the top on it here. And finish making my plate and give you a nice shot of what it's all going to look like. Gosh, that looks, that looks so good. And like I said, I just sauteed this in some light, light butter and some light seasoning because I really want to taste everything that, you know, is, you know, 
in this you know I don't want to taste a ton of salt you know or flavoring lightly I want to be able to taste the pepper especially the chicken of the woods the onion it's gonna be just amazing here and there is my finished product that burger all the fixings some macaroni salad some tater tots and all the extras right here um, you really can't get a better meal than this thank you guys for watching I'll put out some more videos on cooking some other foods and we'll see you down the line